Hi, I'm Kirby Allison, and in today's video, I'm going to show you three essential summerweight trousers, and as a bonus at the end, three of my favorite pair of shorts. As many of you might expect, I enjoy dressing up even in the summer. I might go without a tie, but generally you'll find me with a pair of trousers, a jacket, and a nice shirt. And I can stand that because all of these items are made with the proper fabrics. It's important to remember that high quality clothing is made from 100% natural fibers. Wool, cashmere, linen, cotton. These are fibers that naturally breathe and wick moisture. If it's woven light enough in the eight to 10 ounce range, uh, it is very comfortable even in hot climates like what we have here in Texas. You can also have different types of weaves. So a lot of the summer weight fabrics are what they would call an open weave. It's woven quite loose. This allows it to be lighter weight and then also for some of the air to pass through and to breathe. Examples are your frescoes, your fin morescos, uh, and other types of technical weaves that you see coming out of some of Italy's and England's uh, best fabric mills. So don't let the warm weather discourage you from dressing up. It's just a matter of choosing the right fabrics. First and foremost, everyone knows that I enjoy dressing up formally. Even in the summertime, gray is a foundational color in my wardrobe. The trousers that I'm wearing today are a dark gray pair of Finn Moresco trousers. So this is a cousin of the Fresco fabric. It's very similar, uh, I think, to a grenadine in that it has that open weave. Uh, but again, it is a finer open weave here. That's Finn Moresco, uh, hence the Finn. Uh, and you still have a very fine texture but these are incredibly lightweight, uh, coming in at just right around eight and a half ounces. And because of that open weave, you can almost see through the fabric. If I hold my hand behind the fabric and shine a light behind that, you can see straight through. Now, it doesn't mean that you're gonna be flashing the world as you walk down the street in these things, but it does mean that you're gonna catch a healthy breeze, which is gonna make sure that you're not too warm. Now, Finn Moresco is available in several different colors, and I actually have these trousers in a dark gray, medium gray, and light gray, because again, gray is such an important part of my wardrobe. So, if you're looking for a nice summer weight pair of trousers and want something that's still quite formal, take a look at Finn Moresco's. One of the other things that makes these trousers maybe a touch even more comfortable is the fact that they're cut for braces, which just allows them to hang nice and loose around the waist, which let's be honest, whenever it's hot outside, you want your clothing probably as loose as possible. Coming up next, probably my second favorite pair of trousers, and this is gonna be no surprise, it's probably a little too obvious, and that is a proper pair of linen trousers. Now this pair of trousers right here is from a, a Harriston uh, linen. So this is a beautiful brown. It's really a tobacco brown. It doesn't have any red in it. It's not too dark. It's a beautiful neutral brown that I just find very easy to wear. And it is one of my favorite pair of linen trousers because of just the neutral kind of middle brown. I've got these trousers uh, in three different colors. I've got them in this beautiful brown, which I have to say I really love. Uh, Divige at Divige.com made these for me. So linen, of course, is known for its slightly open weave, uh, its lighter weight, and then of course the linen fibers naturally wick moisture away from the body, um, helping to keep you cool. One of the other signatures of a pair of linen shorts or trousers is that they wrinkle, and this is really something to be embraced. It shows that you're on the inside club of linen, uh, and it is certainly something not to be afraid of. Now, one trick is that even in the summertime uh, is to go for a slightly heavier weight linen. Uh, it doesn't wrinkle in, in a crisp way. The wrinkles really more roll than anything else. And if you use a proper hanger, like our clamping trouser hanger that hangs the trousers upside down, overnight, the majority of those wrinkles will drop out. Uh, these particular trousers, again, uh, cut to my signature style, uh, high-waisted with tabs, uh, cut for braces, they're loose in the waist, uh, easily an inch to an inch and a half of extra inseam right here to ensure that they fit loose and are able to really rise up and down the body as you sit down and stand up. I think it makes them uh, uh, more comfortable. Uh, and then of course, a nice kind of bold two inch turn up. Again, it's one of those details of fine tailoring I absolutely love. And I think for a more casual pair of trousers like this, uh, it really is a finishing touch. So linen pair of trousers, an absolute essential for the summertime. And if you don't own a pair of linen trousers, I would absolutely suggest beginning with a nice tobacco brown such as these. Up next 
is probably, again, one of my favorite pair of trousers. I mean, it's hard to pick favorites whenever you love them all, uh, but this is a really interesting Dorme cloth. Now, Dorme, of course, is the French mill. Uh, they're based in France. Uh, all their stuff is milled uh, in England. Uh, they make some of really the finest fabrics available today. They are uh, epitomous with true luxury. And one of the things I like about Dorme uh, is that although it is a heritage house, they really are on the cutting edge of fine fabrics by really blending together uh, really interesting combinations of fibers uh, while using the latest technology. So first and foremost, you'll notice that this is an absolutely beautiful color. It's great for summertime uh, because oftentimes in summer, you're wearing lighter colored fabrics. This is something I particularly like because it's so neutral. It's an easy to wear neutral color. It's not white, which sometimes can be difficult to pull off, but it's still light enough that it just says summertime. Now this is a 50, 30, 20 wool, silk, and linen. That's right, this has silk and linen blended into the fabric. So 50% of the fiber content of this cloth is silk and linen. The silkness gives it that lightness. Of course, silk is an incredible fiber. It's great for socks. We've got 100% silk socks on the website. We've got silk wool blend socks on the website, which surprisingly are still great for summer. Uh, and that silk, it's a lightweight fiber. It is strong and it naturally wicks that moisture. Now, linen kind of takes that to the next step. Again, it's lightweight, it wicks moisture, but then it adds a touch of visual texture to these trousers that I absolutely like. Now, one of the things that's really interesting about Dorme uh, is that, again, they are really on the cutting edge of their weaving. And so this wears like it's a seven and a half ounce fabric, even though it is heavier than that. So uh, it is incredibly light. This is without question the lightest weight or at least the lightest weight feeling pair of trousers I have in my wardrobe. Uh, and it's a pair of trousers that I have to say I've thoroughly enjoyed and absolutely love. Again, this is from their Naturals collection. Now this is made, again, to my signature style. I've got the turnips on the bottom. I've got it uh, cut uh, with a high rise, uh, pleats, uh, and for braces. I absolutely love these trousers. Also single uh, pleats, which I think, again, give you that essential amount of drape uh, kind of in the front without pulling, uh, without being too full, which sometimes you can get with double pleats. So this, uh, again, is an exceptional pair of trousers that I would absolutely recommend you consider for adding to your summer wardrobe. I mean, just look at how it would look with what I'm wearing today. I mean, of course, I've got a dark gray pair of trousers on right now, but just look at how big of a difference just changing the trousers would make with what I'm wearing right now. I mean, this beautiful oatmeal goes perfectly with this yellow. Uh, this is one of our sovereign grade ties, a really a beautiful summertime kind of daisy tie. Uh, it works uh, perfectly with this shirt, this Charvet shirt that I'm wearing. It's a lighter colored blue also very lightweight and open weave for the summertime. And it works beautifully with this navy hopsack jacket. Again, another jacket, odd jacket that Divige, Divige.com made. Uh, and even look how it kind of ties in with our sovereign grade pocket score right here. You know, in terms of tying in accessories, you're looking to just accent some, some colors. So look at just how this small little tiny yellow detail right here on the floral pattern ties in with the tie. That's all you need to tie in a pocket square, uh, and that's what's fun. Again, you don't want to match too much because uh, that doesn't really look too sophisticated, uh, but that subtle kind of tie-in of the colors uh, really kind of pulls everything together. One other small detail about summer seasonals is that if you're having something made or buying it off the rack, uh, generally you would want it to fit a touch looser uh, than your uh, standard clothing around the year. You want to err slightly on the side of being looser to promote airflow. So that's it for trousers, but I do have a bonus for you, and that is summertime shorts. Now, most people don't think about having their shorts tailored, but I would encourage you to consider it. You're absolutely missing out. My tailored shorts, again, are amongst some of my favorite articles of clothing in the summertime. Let's be honest, there are just some days or some activities uh, where it's too hot or just not appropriate for wearing a pair of trousers. If I'm out at one of Nathaniel's soccer games or if I'm headed to, uh, let's say, the US Open, uh, you know, I'm probably gonna be wearing a pair of shorts. Now, shorts, can be shorts that you buy off the rack, you wear them with the belt, they look just like everything else. But if you're someone that truly enjoys quality craftsmanship and tradition and likes dressing up, a pair of tailored shorts really is one of my favorite summertime accessories. So I've got three here that I absolutely love. So first and foremost, let's start with what's obvious, and that is a pair of oatmeal or tan linen shorts. One of the things about a tailored pair of shorts uh, is that it's almost the same price as a pair of trousers, 
All the work that goes into a pair of tailored shorts is essentially the same as a trouser, except they're just cut off at the knee uh, instead of draping all the way down uh, to your ankles. All the work is the same. These still have a high rise. I maybe would have lowered the rise a little bit on these. Uh, that would be my one suggestion, is to have them not as high rise as a pair of trousers because they will slide down a little bit. But otherwise, I have tabs on the side, no belt, uh, two inch turnips on the bottom, uh, and then single uh, pleats here. Now the style of these shorts uh, is re uh, really very British. Before the late 18th century, early 19th century, it really was unheard of in Britain to see people wearing shorts. But of course, the British Empire expanded to India and the tropics, uh, and you just couldn't get away with a pair of trousers in the military. And that's where this style of short really arose from. So once those military officers came back to Britain uh, at the end of their uh, tours, they brought these shorts with them and they uh, certainly were something that stayed. So I love these linen shorts. Again, a pair of linen properly tailored shorts uh, is something that everyone should have in their summer wardrobe. Uh, and I'd say that if you were to have a pair made, this is where I would go first. But I've had more than one pair of shorts. Let me show you what else I have. Up next, I have a pair of beautiful 100% wool uh, shorts. These are a cream. It is an absolutely beautiful pair of shorts. Not as casual as is linen, but this is a pair of shorts that I would wear to dinner. I would wear to a, a garden party. Uh, I, of course, wore these extensively whenever I was in Mystique. Uh, and if you're looking to kind of dress up, to look sophisticated, but still be quite casual and comfortable during the summertime, uh, these shorts are an absolute home run. I've never worn them and not received a compliment might look a little bit bold, but once you put these babies on, you're gonna thank me. This, of course, is a lightweight fabric in that eight to 10 ounce range. So it's got a beautiful, nice drape, it's 100% wool, but it's not gonna be too hot. And to make these even more comfortable, uh, it is half lined, so you can see in here, we've got lining down all the way, essentially, to right above the knee. So this lining, uh, of course, it helps these trousers drape smoothly but it also allows them to feel even cooler during the summertime. Up last is a pair of 100% cotton twill shorts. This is a heavier weight cotton, a little bit dressier and formal. It has a nice kind of finish to it that gives it a little bit of shine. You can see these embarrassingly are a little bit dirty just because I've been wearing these so much. Uh, but again, I love these shorts. Again, it's a dressier short. It is much more sophisticated than your average short that you would find off the rack uh, pretty much anywhere. Uh, and again, it can be worn down a little bit. It can be dressed up. I've been wearing these into the office during our build outs. You can see all the sheetrock dust. Uh, but this is an absolutely beautiful pair of shorts uh, that I have thoroughly enjoyed and used extensively during the summertime. So uh, if you're someone looking to expand your summer wardrobe, I'd say absolutely consider taking a look at some nice shorts. All three of these are absolute, um, absolute staples to my wardrobe that I have to say. I really have enjoyed. So there we go, three must-have pairs of trousers for the summer and three additional bonus pair of shorts that I've absolutely loved. Remember, whenever it comes to summer clothing, eight to 10 ounce fabrics, open weaves, natural fibers, and slightly loose, and you'll be the best dressed, most comfortable person in the room. Let me know if you have any questions below. Let me know if I missed anything that you love for the summertime. Otherwise, I'm Kirby Allison, and I love to help the well-dressed acquire and care for their wardrobes while exploring the world of quality, craftsmanship, and tradition.